Hello and welcome to Crew Motor Match. My name is Greg and today we're going to be taking a look around this Mercedes-Benz GLA. It's a 2.1 litre and it's the sport variant so it's a very easy on the eye. As we move around to the side of the vehicle and the rear you can see that this car does benefit from that rear privacy glass which does keep your personal belongings out of sight and out of other people's minds. As we move around to the rear you can see that this car does benefit from a lot of chrome accents which give it that nice touch. A very handy feature to note is that this car does come with automatic headlight activation which helps the driver no end and ensures the car is fully visible even in the darkest of nights. This car does boast an 18 inch 5 twin spoke design alloy wheels again adding to that sporty look. And if it's boot space that you're after then look no further than this GLA as with the power operated tailgate it's so easy to unveil a huge amount of boot space enough there for a weekend away or even a set of golf clubs. And as we hop inside, the driver does get to benefit from the multifunctional leather trim steering wheel with controls for the voice commands and the telephone communications on the right hand side and buttons to control the semi-digital dashboard just up ahead. And as we focus our attention on there, it's got every view that you could ever need from a digital speedometer, your fuel consumption, you've even got your trip, your navigation, audio and telephone communications just up ahead, keeping your eyes on the road. And keeping you entertained on them long and tedious journeys is the car's very nifty infotainment system which houses a wide range of applications such as DAB radio but if that's not to your music taste you can connect your phone via bluetooth like I did mention and have your own media and telephone keeping you in touch with your friends and family with ease. You can also scroll through your vehicle settings such as dynamic select which does allow you to change the setup of the car meaning you can opt for a more economical drive, a comfort drive or a sportier drive and making it even easier to navigate around that infotainment system there's also shortcut buttons along the centre console and it also does house that dual zone climate control which does save on a lot of arguments between the passenger and the driver. As we flow through the centre console you can see that it's very clean and concise design with storage compartments and even two cup holders. 